Well, thank you. Breakfast burrito? Here, I got something for you. Here, just dump this all over your burrito. Joey, Brian, and Nick. Get a load of this guy. Yeah, I definitely feel like I just got kicked <laughs> in the face. Oh, fuck. I'm genuinely nervous about this one now. <sighs> what are you made of, Punch Nugget? <laughs> blow, blow. Oh. I'm just gonna wait this out. You're a fucking machine. This stuff is terrible. Is he sweating? I just dumped it all over. Is he sweating? I'm starting to cry a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> there goes a tear. <laughs> Time for a new axle bar. The homemade axle served its purpose and it worked well for the time we had it, but it wasn't used in a home gym setting. I wasn't the only one using it. There were several members deadlifting, clean and pressing, dropping it from overhead every single day, and it couldn't withstand the abuse. So I think it's time to get a real axle bar. Axle bar. Solid? Yeah, heavy, 75 pounds. So what makes an axle bar a real axle bar? This is a solid bar. It's solid, round, 75 pounds. The homemade axles we have were just hollow pipes with little pieces welded on the end. Um, and unlike the homemade axle bars, this thing's not gonna bend. So Joey Zatmary, strongman extraordinaire, is coming to Untamed Strength at the end of April. April like 26, 27, 28. And we've got uh, a weekend planned. So we're gonna be waking up early and uh, grilling a mountain man breakfast, sipping on some campfire coffee. Can you guys name one of the challenges of the axle bar, deadlift moving with axle bar, other than grip? It doesn't bend. Oh, right off the bat, she got one. it. Um, if you use product in your hair and you go through your hair before lifting it, you're gonna be really greasy. And then once you're at the top, it's gonna come down. Uh, you have to be strong, first of all. Right. Uh, second of all, it's further away from your body. Oh and, snap, he's got it. Yeah, and you don't get to bleed on it because it's mostly smooth. Or you can bleed on anything. <laughs> My guess, man. Do I know the last one? Challenge of using the axle bar other than grip, other than diameter, being further away from your body, and other than the bar not bending. Stephanie, you're in this too. Can you name another challenge of the axle bar? Do you guys know? The collars don't roll. Ha ha! The sleeves do not rotate. I was gonna say that, you just interrupted me. We're also gonna do some strongman on Saturday, April 27th. April 27th, Saturday morning from 9 a.m. to noon, we're gonna do some strongman training. He's getting ready for Nats. I've got a competition coming up that I'm hosting, so I'm probably gonna run through some of the events, kind of test the weights. So we're gonna do strongman together, Saturday morning, April 27th. You guys are invited. So if you're in the Northern California area, uh, anywhere near Untamed Strength, come on in, 
Saturday, April 27th, 9 a.m. to noon, and do some strongman with us. Uh, on Sunday, April 28th, from 11 a.m. to about 2 p.m., we're actually gonna do a squat and deadlift workshop. We figured we'd do something where we coach a couple people while we're here. It's open to untamed strength members as well as non-members. That is a paid event. Spots are limited, so uh, we made a sign-up page. I'll include it down in the description area below. But again, I'll recap. Saturday, 9 a.m. to noon, April 27th, we're gonna train strongman, open, free for everybody. Come train with us. I'll probably make a video out of it. And then Sunday, the next day, April 28th, 11 a.m. We're gonna do a squat and deadlift workshop. That's gonna be uh, instruction from us. We'll teach the squat and the deadlift, as well as lifting and uh, you know real-time coaching. You guys are gonna bring your gear just like you were gonna lift. We'll help you out as best we can. Sign up down below. That's it. Thanks for watching. Until next time, always remember, tread on time.